Greetings, this is Sarah Rushlow on behalf of Baker Hunt's Art and Cultural Center here to bring you another fun and exciting art tutorial. Well, let's get started. Today we are going to be drawing with gl school glue and colored pencils. First thing we're going to do, we're going to take um, our glue and we're going to draw whatever we want on our picture. You don't have to make it a drawing that's supposed to represent anything in particular. You could just make it shapes or either geometric or organic shapes, but you can draw things with it. It's really whatever you want it to be. You find your glue getting a little bit sticky, too sticky, too thick, add just a tiny bit of water to it and mix it thoroughly. It'll make it flow better. So you're gonna just fill your whole page as much as you can. You're gonna try to close off these shapes. You'll see why in a second. When you now you're going to take once you're done with this picture, you're gonna let it dry. This may take a little bit, and then you're going to color in with pencil between those shapes you've created, with those shapes you've created. The glue is going to dry clear and the shapes will, and you're going to be left with some black lines that resist being colored by the pencils. So I'm going to set this aside for now. It takes, like I said, it takes a minute to dry. After it's dry, you can work on it some more. While you're waiting for it to dry, you can go and check out Baker Hunt's Art and Cultural Center's Facebook and Instagram page. Be sure to like accordingly. It's really helpful to us. And I have gone ahead and created some drawings with glue and let them dry. So I can show you the second part of this activity. Second part is that you're going to take your colored pencil and you're going to draw in those shapes. I like to outline my mine first, and then I try to keep my pencil lines going the same direction. And I like to use brighter colors because they tend to show up more. So you'll see that I'm drawing shapes, but the la but the black lines are staying black, shiny. I'm kind of playing a game with myself where I am trying to make sure that I don't put two colors next to each other because that's not going to be quite as visually interesting. But it's really up to you. Well, that about does it for today. This has been Sarah Rushlow on behalf of Baker Hunt Art and Cultural Center here to tell you to stay safe, stay creative, and I'll see you next time. Bye.